The Class A State Wrestling Tournament has been a scene of disappointment the last two years for Glendive Jr. Nelson Crisofoli, but those back-to-back -back third place finishes have pushed him harder than ever. The offseason, I think that kind of got at him a little bit and he's come back a little more focused. Uh, he still has his uh, Nelson moments, but uh, um, oh, he's come back and, and I think it was good for him last year, that third finish, because he's a little hungrier. I just kind of had a had a sour taste in my stomach to wrestling after that. And then the summer before my uh, junior year, I just worked a lot harder than I did. And now that I'm here, I'm just trying to roll with as much energy as I can. Those Nelson moments are just part of the energy that he brings to the table. His lighthearted personality keeps the atmosphere around the Glendive team loose. He's always smiling, always joking around. Sometimes, sometimes he kind of got to smack him and tell him that it's time to be serious. And uh, he's always goofing with somebody, but he's pretty fun-loving, easy-going kid. Wrestling is just, it's kind of like just a burden on the body almost, and like practices are, you know, they're hard and really tiring and stuff. And so you got to have fun once in a while and just like crack jokes all the time to just, you know, remember why you're here and creating bonds with your teammates and stuff like that. Chris Afoli is among the favorites for the 170-pound title in Class A this year, and he's hungry for a shot at redemption but he won't soon forget the gut-wrenching defeat at last year's state tournament. Just gotta work harder than I've worked at anything in my life and just always keep in the back of your mind what the sour taste of losing is. It's a taste that Chris Foley hopes to soon cleanse from his palate. Alec Boffinger, MTN Sports.